Here at the, at the Thames Drama School, pupils are not permitted to paraphrase. And uh, by that I mean, if the script says uh, he was bent on seeing her, then you must say he was bent on seeing her and not the sight of her doubled him up. You see? <laughs> and you have to keep the script. And with this in mind, the passing out piece is this poem by Walter Winchell, and it's called Faith, Hope and Charity. And it has to be read as it was typed 20 years ago on a very old typewriter on which the letter H was missing. <laughs> Here then is Fate, Hope and Charity <laughs> by Water Winkle. <laughs> Professor of Czechoslovakian philosophy and mats. <laughs> Next door to a sop that sells fish and kips <laughs> in Arawani Hill lived Philip, <laughs> a pissy old therapist. <laughs> His cums all caught him pill. He was very muck in love <laughs> with a girl called June. He pwned her whenever he could. <laughs> he sent her a cockerlet box. <laughs> Cock a block with cockolets. <laughs> but it didn't do any good. He picked her favourite flowers, then gave them to her in a bunk. <laughs> he tried to sin up her drain pipe. <laughs> so she invited him in for lunk. She offered him kicking sandwiches <laughs> and a charcoal drilled lamb cop. <laughs> He just kept smoking and queuing his queuing gum. <laughs> she thought he'd never stop. She said, I can't enjoy our little cat with your ass all over the floor. <laughs> Why don't you put your ass in the ashtray? <laughs> That's what the damn thing's for. He said, marry me or live with me. I really don't care, Wick. <laughs> she said, I'll give you my boot, you uncoot ute. <laughs> Get out, don't come back till you're Rick. Then along came Peavy, <laughs> wearing a King Killer fur coat that almost reeked to the ground. The couple met in a laundrette while he was watching his wazzing go round. <laughs> she said, I'm no soapier, Lauren. I know that my sate's not so hot. I may be old in a toot. My teat may be false. But I could give you a suck a lot. <laughs> you dine on roast peasant. You drink killed campaign as you lay on some sun drenched beak. I may be 63, but I've the skin of a peak. He said, Yeah, 63 year old peak. She said, Sew me a little carroty. You shall have my last farting. <laughs> Of tact, I give you my word. They were married next day, up Arrogant Way. Thursday. Mark the turd. <laughs> when I banged on the door of his fine oming kickerster, I got suck a nasty sock. I heard him mutter, oh, sit. <laughs> to his dog, who was running a mop. <laughs> he said he'd a happy life, full of good cheer, and a lady Tatty could adore. He said a May-December marriage worked fine for him, but then June had the house next door. 